congratulations, World Championship debut, victory at Alexandra Palace. Just try and sum up how you're feeling right now. I'm absolutely buzzing with it, mate. I was saying to everyone, after the first set, I was bad nerves, shaking. Went off stage, came back up. As soon as I won one leg, just everything went back to normal. It's like winning that one leg and just settle everyone down. And it's just done that to me. What was it like arriving in London for the first time, seeing this great building on top of Mudswell Hill? Did the nerves hit as soon as you arrived? I thought it was small when I came in, <laughs> like on TV. It was massive. I was walking I was walk, I play, walk in Friday with Woodhouse. This isn't as big as I thought. But this problem's amazing, absolutely amazing. What's it been like since the time you qualified to the time you stood at the top of the walk on? Because I bet it seems an eternity, doesn't it? Didn't sink in until the walk on. When I was walking up, I was like, right, you know, it's hitters now. Just don't try and throw anything, so I was like, I've got a steel face on. I know the last two years has been bitterly disappointing for yourself, but has tonight just banished that altogether? Oh, yeah, completely. Yeah. Obviously, the, the Q school I know I'm, I'm called Combat King, aren't I? <laughs> I don't like getting called that, or, but I'm there to prove people wrong. I'm not count back it. I'm really, as soon as I get my card, I, I think I'll do well. And I don't think I'll play too bad there. Do you think playing in some of the Pro Tours before the end of the season helped you confidence-wise getting to the latter stages of them as well? Yeah, I, 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 I practice with Chris Dolby nearly every week because I live 100 yards away from him. So it's not too bad for me, you know, practice with him and two other lads. I, Really like that dog, Brian and Ian Arto. So it's, it's amazing. Just, they're always there when I'm down, they pick me up. It's absolutely amazing. We've seen the likes of Luke Woodhouse cause huge upsets here so far. Did that give you confidence that you could do the same? Well, I've been practicing with Luke in the hotel and he was practicing really well. Now, if you take that on stage, you're going to do well. He's not yet, and I obviously just went home to see his, um, his kids and that, so I'm a bit gutted he's not yet. But yeah, he's. He's done amazing, and that did give me a lot of confidence. The game itself, as you said, lost the first set, then you're in the lead, then you're going into a final set. Did it play with all your emotions up there today? It did, yeah. I was set there a lot. When I won the set and set 3-0, all right, that's it. And I won the next set 3-0. And I started to win the first leg, and then he won that one 3-0. I was like, oh my God, just hit the double. But when I went to 2-2, and then two like, oh, man, my nerves were like that. Sudden death leg, you've missed the dart to win the match, and he's sat on 87, are you thinking it's got over? I did, when I, looked, when, I seen it, when I seen he hit the 51, I, I just turned away, I was like, oh, no, not again. And then I heard 51, and that just, in my head, I was always going to go 9, 4, double 8, but if you hit the 17 or any of the bottom segment, apart from the two, you're on a double. On my head, that's what I went for. Your little quarter of the draw has been blown completely open. Danny Noppet up next, and then the winner of that place, Kim Hybrex. There's a huge chance for someone to really stamp their name on this William Hill World Darts Championship, isn't there? Yeah, there is, yeah, but I, I, I don't really look at the draw. I just find out when I play, and then that's it. I prepare from there. I know I play Thursday now, obviously with Chris, the same session as Doby, so we'll get some practice when he comes down tomorrow. Would that be helpful, you having Chris here to yeah. practice with as well? He, he, he settles me down. If I'm ever hitting so much slack or being lazy, he, he tells us, come on, not, not lazy. For every dot the same. And that's, what I, that's the best thing about Chris. So he just tries to help everyone. Even at local competitions, he, he speaks to everyone. He, he tries to help and do everything for everyone. That hotbed of darts up in the northeast, does that really help you settle into being a professional as well then? Yeah, I, I don't. I play a Super League with uh, Chris's dad and uncle, and Chris plays for the other team, so when we play each other, it's a bit rivalry between them. And like Ryan Joyce plays for the same team as Chris, who plays Thursday, I think. So when we play each other, I would always want to play each other. They can just try and smash each other off the board, but it's really good up north. Cam, congratulations, thank you very much. Thank you, mate. Oh, no. I'm from German television. I just wonder, will you get the feeling, you know, the new ones seem to kick out the old guys? Do you have that feeling as well? Double sorry? Do you have the feeling as well that the young guys are kicking out the old ones, the old guard in a way? No, not really, no. Even the old, old lad, that's all right. Gary, I was watching Gary practice yesterday. He was absolutely un
So no, I don't, I don't see that. But it's really good that I've seen on social media there's 22 debutants. And it's, I'm, I'm one of them, obviously. That's, that's amazing. That's absolutely amazing. I tried to ask you, you talked about your nerves. How did you calm them down? Because you have hardly any seconds to concentrate again. It's, it's just like I said, when I, when I had a chance at the double, as soon as I hit, it doesn't matter where I play, if I, as soon, if I get one leg, I just settle down, doesn't matter if I'm 3 0 down, 5 0 down, or it's the first leg. I just settle down as soon as I win one leg. And finally, did you hear the crowd shouting for you at all, or do you shut it out altogether? I tried to shut it out, but it didn't work. <laughs> <laughs> what did you hear? I'm not going to repeat it. <laughs> Thank you.